Hi everyone, I'm Gizem Solmaz. Uh, I'm I'm going to talk about open access and preprints today. Um, let's start like what open access mean. Open access uh, refers to free online availability of research articles without any restrictions on ac access, reuse, or sharing. This means that anyone anywhere in the world can read and use the research without having to pay a fee or obtain permission. And it has like many important, like many important reasons. I want to like uh, include here three of them. The first reason is like open access increases the visibility and impact of the research. Because like, as you all know, sometimes peer review or publishing the articles takes longer terms than we would expect it. Like sometimes like two years, three years. And some of the like researcher findings are in like in, in immediate need need to um, publish their results because they can build upon it. I think we saw a really important example during the COVID time. So it like through open accesses, this uh, process can be faster. It promotes core collaboration and innovation in a faster way because researchers will be able to reach out your um, results and publications from any background or any affiliation. And it supports the principles of public ac access to knowledge. Like I said, like your, um, your publications will be available to any, anybody in the world and uh, regarding of their background. And what preprint means? Like a preprint is the manuscript copy of an article that is sent to publishers for consideration and peer review. It's a version of a research article that has not been yet peer reviewed or published in a traditional journal. And they have generally their own repository, repository series to um, publish. And like I included like two um, examples here and, and they are freely accessible to anyone. Uh, preprints are becoming incre increasing popular in many scientific disciplines, and they allow researchers to share their findings quickly and easily without having to wait for lengthy peer review and publication processes. And it promotes receiving feedback on their work before it is published in a traditional journal, and it helps identify potential collaborators for the future uh, directions of the research. So what, what, what is the like open science framework's role in open access and preprints? Open science framework is an online platform that provides a free open science, open source platform for managing research projects. So as you can see, actually like, um, like op, uh, open access and preprints are already embedded inside of open science framework. It has uh, features and integrations with the preprint servers like BRVix and SciRVix. And this integration allows researchers to easily deposit their preprints on these servers directly from Open Science Framework, making it quick and easy to share their research with the wider community. Uh, Open Science Framework provides a range of tools and resources to support open and reproducible research practices. And this include like data management tools, project management tools, and collaboration features that makes it easier to work with others on the research project. Um, I included some resources to learn about more, learn more about open access and preprints, but if you have any questions, feel free to send me an email. Thank you so much.